Hello YouTube, my name is Abum and now I will continue about music application. And now I will add a delete function. Here I have a button album delete, maybe like this. And double click this. And now I need query here. Right click in album, add query, and use SQL and delete. Next, and okay, go to query builder, right click and add table, album, add, and close. Now, delete from album and where where album number equal question mark just like this and press ok and next and delete delete album maybe like this next finish ok and I need function Okay, go to build and build application and I need function here and I add variable team gp as new and a m ah, a s data set table adapter dot album table adapter and here gp dot delete delete album and I need I need one parameter I need here copy paste and value cell zero okay I think it's right and if I check this I copy this and uh, paste and okay I need variable copy and here paste and here I need a value copy and paste here and maybe okay I try to database explorer and table and album zero one two three I need cell three okay if I have file axis and now I need I don't need this okay I don't need this I just need a delete okay delete function if file exists I need a file dot delete and okay I just add like this okay if I try to add album admin one two three four login AA DD and okay add I have this and delete Okay. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Okay, maybe. Okay, I try to check. Okay, I have file delete here, but I don't have delete here. Okay, maybe I need trim. Okay, maybe like this. I try again.
Oke. Delete. Oke. Okay. I think it's clear and I need uh, this function. I need refresh. Oke, okay, and now if I try again, I have delete function. Login and a a d d. Okay, if I check in here, I just have a image like this, and if I add. Okay, I have two, and if I delete this, I have one. Okay, uh, I think this is function is correct, and um, you must check. You must check if file exists, and you must delete the file and you can add function like this and you can add split and okay i think it's it's cool and you must try to use database in visual basic 2010 and i hope you like my tutorial if you like my tutorial please subscribe my youtube channel and thanks for watching, goodbye.